Bobby Birds by John Harley Read for LibriVox.org by Jim I wandered out one summer's morn Across a meadow newly shorn Sun was shining bright and clear And fragrant scents rose up in air And all was still When as my steps were idly roving I come upon a sight so loving It filled me out with tender feeling As down I sank beside it kneeling or the edge, or the hill. It were a little skylark's nest, and two young babby birds undressed, were gaping with a beak so wide, calling for mammy to provide their morning's meal. And I upon the little loam, the sander daddy's warbling come, ringing so sweetly on me ear, like breathing through a pure sphere. He sang so well, the mammy a few yards away, were hopping on a bit of hay, to fear to come to bolt to flee, and watching me with troubled ease, she seemed to say, Don't touch me bonny babs, young man. The daddy does the best he can to cheer you with his sweetest song, and those'll sing as we are lay along, so let them stay. That ain't thing I'd do em arm, come shelter em and keep em warm, for I've a little nest me sin, and two young babs I'm proud to tell, that's precious too. And they've a mammy watching there, a tow's them little ends a dear, and dearer still if that can be. Now what these young uns are to thee? So come now do, ah well that shy thou ups away, thou doesn't trust a word I say, thou thinks I'm here to rob and plunder. Ah, I confess I do not wonder, but there's no need. I'll leave thee to yourselves good bye. But now I see your daddy's nigh. He's dropped that strain so sweet and strong. He loves you better nor his song. He does indeed. I walked away and saw me ear. Caught up the sand a warbling clear. Thinks ah they're happy once again. I'm glad I didn't prove so mean. To rob that nest. For they're contented with a lot. Nor envied me with little cot. And in this world as we go through. Tisn't much good that we can do, and do our best. Then let us do as little wrong, to only as we pass along, and never seek a joy to gain. That's purchased with another's pain, tisn't right. And shall go home we later at, to mend our Johnny's little cat. He always finds me work enough, to piecing up his broken stuff, for every neat. And Sally's eye, if you could see her, when I sit down to get me tear, she puts a dolly on me knee, and makes me sing it hush a bee, in the rocking chair, then begs her sugar for it too, what it can't eat she tries to do, and turning up a cunning knee, she rubs a dull mouth and says you see, it gets its share, sometimes I'm rather cross off here, and starts a little trembling tear, and like a drop of glittering dew, swimming within a wild flower blue, falls from the tree. But as the sun in April shares, revives a little dropping flares, kind word brings the sweet smile back. I really think we brain'd crack if they to dee. Then if I love me bein so well, may knit a skylark's bosom veil. As me concern for little things, at snooze of the shelter of which her wings, so well affords, if folk what no but here but mind, how much is gained by being kind. There's fewer breasts with grief had swell, and fewer folk a thoughtless mill, even birds. End of recording. This recording is in the public domain.